Good morning, Good morning Mustangs. Mustangs. Today is Monday, April 23rd. I'm your host, Elise. And I'm your host, Anthony. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Pledge of Salute Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We will now say the Mustang Pledge. Today, I will do my best to be the best. I will listen, I will follow directions, I will be honest, I will respect the rights of others, I can learn, I will learn, I know it's all up to me. Now for a moment of silence. Please be seated. Lunch today is chicken and waffles or yogurt box and lunch, potato rounds or baby carrots, apple wedges or orange juice, and delicious cold milk. And now we have a few announcements. Today, we will be having our classroom spelling bees. Tomorrow night, there will be a PTA meeting at 6 p.m. The Millwood Chorus will be performing their spring concert. Please make plans to attend. On Thursday, grade level spelling bees will take place for kindergarten first and second grade. On Friday, grade level spelling bees will take place for third, fourth, and fifth grade. On Saturday, Sumter will host annual Heart Walk to benefit the American Heart Association. Next week is Teacher Appreciation Week. Start thinking of ways you can say thank you to your favorite teachers. You could draw a picture, write a note, or just say thank you and offer your hug to your teacher. And now for a few words from Dr. Leach. Good morning, Mustangs. I hope you had a restful and enjoyable weekend. And I have a guess because yesterday in the newspaper, Millwood Elementary School made the front page, which is excellent. It's always good to make the front page for something good. So I have our special guest, Mrs. Holloway, and I'll let her tell you why we were in the paper for something positive. Good morning, Ms. Holloway. Good morning, good morning, children. Good morning, everybody. Here it is, front page. I just wanna tell you how proud I am of each and every one of you. You did an awesome job. You did very well carrying the banner. Thank you, fifth graders. Um, everybody did so well. We got in the paper because I sent an email to Mrs. Galloway. She is our PR director, um, and she sent the newspaper out. Um, so they took a bunch of pictures of y'all, and um, I guess, um, Jane and Barry, you're on the front page holding the main um, flag of the Earth Day. But we do this every year in celebrating the Earth, and you know that this is your earth and that we have studied um, a great deal about keeping it clean and um, again I'm just so very proud of each and every one of you it's like Dr. Leach said it's always very special to see our name on the front page of the new pa newspaper especially on a Sunday because everybody gets the Sunday paper and thank you so much for working so hard in the science lab Again, thank you, Ms. Holloway, for all that you do for our students here at, at Millwood. And also, we did have another teacher being recognized in the newspaper on, on yesterday, Mrs. Wise, for being the Air Force Association Teacher of the Year. She was recognized last week, Wednesday, when representatives um, from the chapter came out, and they gave her her award and a monetary gift. So again, congratulations, Mrs. Wise, for all that you do for our students here. We had a few birthdays over the weekend, and we, ha we had um, Jordan Miller in Mrs. Walter's class, and Jordan Anthony in Ms. Pinsker's class. So when you see these students, make sure you tell them happy belated birthday. And we have two birthdays today. We have Mia Bohr in Mrs. Sims' class, and Amarni Wright in Mrs. Glover's class. So happy birthday. Now for a few words of wisdom before we close the Mustangs. One of the most important choices we ever make is choosing our friends. Good friends support us in being our best. Good friends encourage us to do the right thing. They help us through bad times and celebrate with us during the good times. Now listen to this proverb. Go with the good and you will be one of them. If you have good friends who help you being the very best that you can be, be very thankful. Better yet, tell your friends how much you appreciate them for his or her friendship. With something to think about, this is Dr. Leach. Make it a great day or not, the choice is always yours. Now for the drawings. The kindergarten, our winner today is Honesty Kennedy in Ms. Osteen's class, given by Mrs. Mills for good behavior. First grade, we have Jacob Bowen in Mrs. Buckner's class, given by Mrs. Buckner for good behavior. 
two were stuck together. For second grade, we have Shaolin Lee and Mrs. Lim's class, given by Mrs. Lim for good behavior. Third grade, it's a lot of third grade in here. Can't hardly get my hand in here. But I do have a winner, and it is Covina Sumter in Mrs. Burns' class for hard work. For fourth grade, we have Alexandra Varquez in Mrs. Horn's class, given by Mrs. Kent. And for fifth grade, we have Serena Campbell in Mrs. Love's class, given by Mrs. Love for meeting her map goal. Congratulations. Um, remember, this is another week of school, so that means another week of a lot of good teaching and good learning. And now I'm back to our host and co-host. Don't forget attendance, academics, and behavior. Bye, Mustangs.